heartbreaking. In fact, his family says that this incident was life changing for everyone involved. Now, Abdullah Bayliss is just one of the survivors from the crash that happened right here behind me on the North Freeway. And they say right now they cannot visit him in the hospital because of the COVID-19 uh, crisis. But they say they want to make sure they give the update and get this message across. He will never have a full recovery. 23 year old Abdullah Bayliss narrowly escaped with his life after this crash on the North Freeway. I personally love him as a son. His uncle tells me Bayliss is known for helping others, and that's what he was doing early Friday morning when he was driving along the North Freeway near Rankin and saw two vehicles pulled over on the freeway. The incident caused a chain reaction in another truck crash trying to avoid hitting them. Bayliss stopped to help, but moments later, an 18-wheeler slammed into the vehicles. Bayliss jumped off of the freeway to save his own life. He's not in the trees. He's on the ground. A more than 15-foot drop. Just sad to, to, to hear what happened. His uncle says both of his legs had to be amputated. Just imagining a guy cannot run to pick up his daughter, that's a life-changing right there. Bayliss suffered several other injuries, and he's still in the ICU. His family says they are holding on to their faith.